Today's a little bit of a special video because we will be talking about brain rock content. Now, brain rock content has been a thing for generations upon generations, especially on YouTube.com. This shitty website can't get enough brain rot, honestly. But let's be honest, brain rot is kind of like a necessary evil for YouTube. That's why there's so many fucking stupid kids on this website. Now, brain rot has been a thing for generations, but the brain rot I grew up with was MLG slop and YouTube poop videos. Now, all I can explain for YouTube poop is when there's smoke, they pinch back. And also for MLG, well, just look at it. Fuck it right in the pussy! Wow! That was one of the more coherent videos, by the way. But anyway, now there's a new type of brain rot on the block. What's that new type of brain rot on the block? Max Design Pro videos. People don't like these very much. The same people I see that grew up with fucking MLG slop and YouTube poop videos are now hating on people like Max Design Pro because they just want to get a bag. And honestly, I'm getting sick of it. As a commentary slop channel, let my homies get the bag. Would I rather have my child watching this or fucking Elsa Gate? Now, to be fair, I also see people justify the slop, basically saying, no, there's actually lore to it. There's this, this, this. Honestly, I don't really give a fuck, okay? As long as it's entertaining, it's entertaining. And I I think Max Design Pro is just kind of harmless. I'll tell you one thing that's worse than Max Design Pro though. YouTube Shorts Commentary Channels. Now, 100%, totally no sarcasm at all. I think there's an argument to be made that these channels are worse than Hitler, but I don't know. I don't know. I mean, that's just me though. I mean, let's be honest though. These channels hating on brain rock content they're also brain rot, like, let's be honest. It's brain rot on brain rot violence. They're just hating on channels like Max Design Pro because they want to get a bag and they're doing more brain rot more efficiently than fucking the average commentator that just sits in their room and makes videos. And I'm not hating on fucking brain rot content like Rith because it's brain rot. If you want to get the bag, get the bag. But one thing I'm not going to stand for is Max Design Pro slander, because Max Design Pro is possibly the greatest brain rot of all time. Just kidding, MLG was better, but I guess it's up there. Anyway, I guess we can talk about the Rith video that he made on Max Design Pro. Alright, without further ado, grab your popcorn and, yeah, just play the video. I don't really feel like being loud. It's Saturday morning and I feel like dying. <laughs> So, uh, ladies and gentlemen, is this what you guys find funny? Did the generations before us really extract all the humor that possibly existed in this universe? So now we're resorting to chicken nuggets being like, <laughs> Really, motherfucker? Okay, let's be honest. Are we really just gonna act like we didn't grow up with fucking MLG slop? Are we really just gonna act like that? I mean, what's the difference between that and... <laughs> I guess you can go for, I guess, the newest brain rot isn't as smart with a question mark. I don't really know. I mean, come on. We clearly breeded the best, not the brightest. 10.6 million subscribers on YouTube and 100% of the content is complete slop. Let's begin. Bro, what the f*** happened to kids' animation channels being educational? I could've swore, audience, the cartoons that I used to watch whenever I was a kid, it taught you how to be a responsible and respectful kid. Animated educational channels? I don't think I've ever seen a good one on YouTube. Like, this isn't even a joke or anything. Like, I don't think I've ever seen a uh, animation educational channel that's actually not shit on YouTube. I mean, if you really want a animation educational channel, then fucking, um, watch TV, what the fuck? Like, Nickelodeon is still a thing, bro. Now that I'm looking at videos like this, it's just teaching kids to be a little bit. Now I think about it, his point makes even less sense. Bro, Caillou came out in like 1997, come on. Ah. 
kind of a weird choice of sound effects to put on a kid's YouTube channel, but okay. Like seriously, audience, imagine if you were a parent and then you heard your five-year-old kid on the iPad and you hear the sound effects of- oh! Bro, I don't know what you're talking about. I guess this guy has never had a moment in the shower where the water is either too cold or too hot. He just always has it at the right temperature. I think you're just fucking weird, bro, low-key. I mean, come on, like, you've never had that moment when you're in the shower? Oh, right, this guy doesn't take showers, but... Okay, everyone else in the audience, you've never had that moment where, like, you take, like, a shower and the water is, like, too hot and it's like... Arr! Like, you, like, it's like that. You make, like, a Tom and Jerry sound effect. <laughs> You're gonna take away the iPad for a month. You're gonna give him a Quran or a Bible or something. This video was haram. Stop moaning in the fucking microphone. Go outside and stop listening to beavers moan, you fucking weird ass. I don't know if this guy's mentally retarded or not, but that is not a fucking beaver. How the fuck does that look like a beaver? That's obviously a monkey. Now, I don't know what type of monkey it is, but like, I don't know how you got that with beaver. Like, it's pretty obvious it's a monkey, but like... I'm not sure what type of- actually, real quick question, what type of monkey even is this supposed to be? Like, seriously, what even type of monkey is this supposed to be? Huh? Why the f*** are you guys staring at me like that? Brody's looking at me like EDP looking at a two-year-old. Hey guys, Peter Griffin here to explain a joke. You see on wait when did the EDP thing happen again? I low key forgot. Like it's been a it's been a while. But anyway, fucking uh I don't know if you should really be talking about characters having deadpan expressions. Honestly, this character's been staring at what is he even staring? Is he staring at a computer? Like like what's on the other side? I'm really curious. Also, completely off topic from touching two-year-olds, can we acknowledge the 1,000 IQ move that this beaver just did? I'll be sure to remember next time, Max Design Pro, when I see a bunch of spiders getting eaten by a bird, to grab one of the deadly spiders that are big as the palm of my fucking hand and move it to the side because spiders surely need to live. What a great message you're promoting to kids. Let's have them touch ants the size of their fucking skull. Dude, not gonna lie, I think this guy is just jealous. He's not as smart as Max Design Pro. Like, come on, Max Design Pro is like the smartest YouTuber of all time. Like, let's be honest. How else did he get 10 million subs just off of kada 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 kada? Oh, I've been married a long time. Like, how the fuck did he get 10 million subs based off that? Clearly, he's doing something right. I mean, clearly, the dude is smart if he's fucking able to just take advantage of brain rot just like that. Maybe I'll do a video where, like, proving mathematically that Max Design Pro is the greatest YouTuber of all time time but that'll probably be for the future until then like yeah no You know, after all these videos that I'm seeing, I'm starting to understand how they got 10.6 million subscribers. Because, uh, I'm sure if I did this exact thing on my YouTube channel, I think I would see 10 million subscribers too. No, you wouldn't, dude. You suck at making videos. Because just like the ants in this video, these kids that subscribe to Max Design Pro, they love being told what to do. If something on the screen tells them to leave a like in the video, they're gonna leave a fucking like. I'm gonna be honest, I mean, you could kind of maybe say he's right here, but like, this has been the thing for ages. I remember back in the day when YouTubers would used to say, like and subscribe for 10 years of good luck and all this shit, like, or be fucking, remember Futuristic Hub and his little things in the video where he's like, But the video starts with a nice message telling the kiddies out there that if they don't like it, then Pennywise will get them tonight. Some of them say things like, 20,000 likes or something for the next part. And I have no problem with that. I get it, you have to know if the viewers are interested and all, but really... This video will haunt your dreams if you forget to like and share. Signed, fucking Bandy. Man, bro, futuristic hub. What a horrible time to be alive. I'm kind of glad he's gone. I wish he would come back, though. It's like none of these motherfuckers that actually subscribe to Max Design Pro, they genuinely are incapable of thinking for themselves. It's wow, you're telling me the channel that's watched by, like, seven-year-olds, like, they don't know what the fuck they're doing and they'll just like if you tell them to? Wow, it's almost like Max Design Pro is only taking advantage of the game because, really, this has been a thing for a long time, for years upon years. Wow, you're definitely really saying something new here, bro.
Gada gadi gada gada oh. What? Help me. I swear, anytime I ever compliment a channel that I react to, the very next video that follows after the previous video I reacted to is complete dog shit. Yo, Loki, I kind of hate it when commentary channels say that. It's like you pick the videos yourself, you fucking retard. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> what? Help me. As I said at the beginning of this video, audience, is this really the humor that we've resorted to? Roblox chicken nuggets escaping the other Roblox chicken nugget police officer? Are you fucking me? We are so doomed as a society. It's only down from here. Anyways, audience, if you want some content that'll give you a fucking six pack from laughing so hard, I just wanted to let you know that I exist. Let's get to five million subs. Actually, wrong answer. I think we should all be subscribing to Max Design Pro right now. Clearly, the greatest YouTube. YouTube channel of all time no questions asked but yeah anyway honestly i think this whole thing of hating on brain rot i feel like it's just a cycle people hate it on fucking youtube poops people hate it on mog people hate it on us commentary channels and now us commentary channels are hating on other people that just want to get the bag for fuck's sake it's honestly so fucking embarrassing like what am i really gonna hate on max design pro because they just want to get the bag from doing shitty gadakadi gadakada oh videos like come on like, like, be, let's be realistic here. Let's be realistic. They just want to earn the bag just like us. So, you know what? Fuck it. I kind of respect Max Design Pro, to be honest. I mean, would I rather have my child watching this or fucking Elsa Gate? Anyway, that's kind of it for this video. And this is just kind of a long video, but yeah. Anyway, fucking, sorry, I haven't been making much commentary videos lately. I've been doing other stuff. I've been busy with school. I've been busy with other things. So yeah, that's about it. Thank you for the support. And yeah, good luck, everybody.